What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel and you're here. Um, I want to do a quick uh, video today. Uh, the purpose of today's video is going to be, we're going to be installing this cover right here. A um, couple days ago Elias came over and uh, we went ahead and finished uh, all the intercooler piping from here. We drilled the hole to come to the throttle body. All this piping is completed. Uh, I'll be taking the last pipe here to, to get it uh, a couple plugs welder for the blow up valve and um, the little hose, that hose right there, that one. So um, I should be able to have that probably by the end of next week. But today's focus is going to be putting the cover uh, back in place. So let me go pick it up and let's get to it. Oh, before I do that, let me show you something. The intercooler piping is done on this side. So I'm very happy with the way all that turned out. A friend of mine from work named Dakota, he helped me get the, um, these little brackets cut and drilled um, so that I could, you know, have more support on in the intercooler. So shout out to Dakota. Thank you, man. Um, I mean, that looks good. Real good. I just have to get a couple more from here to right there for additional support. I think that that is going to be more than enough. But anyways, uh, let me go get the cover uh, and we'll get going. All right, so here is the cover. Yeah, take a quick look at this. All the way around, the thing looks impressive. And very, very pleased with results. This damn powder coating. If you need off to help you with all your powder coating needs, uh, give send them a message, reach out to them. I mean, the man will do you right, and the price prices are very, very fair. So, here, here's the cover. Now, this is the same color as that right there, and I believe the color code, it's a uh, lollipop red. That's what it's called. But um, I am very, very happy with results. This should look really, really good once it's done. All right, so for these, you're gonna need an eight millimeter for the three bolts that are gonna hold the, this little thing right here, what's it called, the cam uh, sensor, whatever it's called, I can't remember right now. And then you're gonna need a tin for the, for the bolts that are gonna hold the actual plate inside, so. Let me go ahead and situate the camera so you can get, have a good clear view of what's going on. Right there. Okay, perfect. All right, so let me get this, this here out the way. It's really simple, it just slides in and out, just, just like that. Oh yeah. Well, I might have spoken too soon. It's not wanting to go in. Okay, there. Let me get these bolts. Now the bolts, they're kind of filthy. So I've been looking for some dress out bolts. Um, if anybody knows a link or a store that does uh, dress out bolts, please put them in the comment section. Um, I need to get something better looking than what this here looks like. Okay, I'm just gonna go in. It's not wanting to go in. I'll tell you. Where's the dog going? Really? Okay, there you go. It was not trying to cooperate. <laughs> so. All right, we got those two in. Next, we're gonna put the these ones right here. Uh, there to hold the bottom of the cover. There's uh, they you gotta use an eight millimeter socket. So let me see if I can situate the camera one more time. I, had a, I like the position that it was. Mm -hmm. Probably not, maybe right there? No, right there. I'm just gonna hold it with my hand. 
All right, so one in the center. I have no idea how many times this little thing has, you know, pulled me out of a bind, especially in tight places like under there. Man, what a nightmare that, that was. But that little thing held me out. <laughs> it's a lifesaver. Here's the second one. Come on, come on, come on. If y'all know of a company that does dress up bowls, like I said earlier, please put it in the comment section. Uh, I, I really want to give me something better looking than that. Um, I wanted to match the rest of the stuff what's going on. So put, give me a give me a comment. Give me a comment on that. Let me know what you you know of a company that does that, so I can reach out to them. Got one more down here. Okay, let me put the camera to the side for a little bit. as much as I can by hand before I put the socket to work. Oh, excuse me. Okay, that should be it right there. Now there is, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm missing something right there. I gotta, gotta go around the garage and look for it because this thing is loose, shouldn't be like that. All right. Next is the these right here. While I had it out, I went ahead and painted it black. Um, I went looking for a replacement, but I couldn't find a new one. Um, so just painted it, and it looks fairly decent. Don't look good, but it looks pretty decent. It looks better than what it did when it came when I got the car. So um, I actually went ahead and bought a brand new seal for it as well, um, just so that it, you know, again, the, the old seal that was in place, it was really rough, but uh, that one looks pretty good right now. Trying to line them up too, so you don't lose it. This one look bad, but I do need some dress up balls, y'all. Okay, one. It's a pretty simple task, pretty simple task. Um, it's not that really complicated, it's just... <sighs> so I have to get your hands in there.
that's it. Now, these here, it clips on pretty much. Uh, right there. Come on, come on. Work with my, mm -hmm. There you go. Now, I can, all I have to do is plug it up. Clipping. It doesn't want to clip. Let me put the camera down for a little bit. Okay. Oh, perfect. So there you have it. It's on. Oh, I like it. I like the way it looks all the way across. I just gotta get some new dress out bolts. What you guys think? Let me know in the comment section. You like it? I know I do. <laughs> Man, that looks good. That looks really, really good all together. Now somebody asked me, well, why are you choosing that color? Are you trying to imitate the GTR color, uh, the RB26? No, it's not that I'm trying to imitate or trying to present something that is not. It's just that I really like the color. I like the finish. I like the, I, I just like it. So I went with it. Yeah, that looks good. That looks really good. All right, guys. That is it. I'll see y'all next time. Uh, next time I'm gonna be doing, uh, I'm gonna be doing a little bit more electrical work. I gotta just extend this so that, and all these hoses, they're gonna go away. So, you know, don't, don't worry about that color right there. Uh, I bought some electrical stuff to go ahead and finish the wiring on this so that I can go ahead and, you know, go ahead and put that in place and be done with, the, with that right there. And then uh, my injector should be coming up shortly. Once I get my, uh, the plug for the diverter valve welded in here. I'm gonna go ahead and, you know, do a video while all this is going on. So, all good stuff. Again, Dakota, thank you very much for them brackets. Really, really good. There's the final result. Y'all be safe out there.